Mikey Schwartz filling in for Jono, and welcome to Big Shiny Things. Earlier today at their Unpacked Expo in Berlin, Samsung announced their highly anticipated Galaxy Gear smartwatch. Using a touchscreen interface to swipe between functionality, the Gear features seamless integration with your smartphone, as one would expect, allowing you to check text messages, take calls, as well as a host of other smart device features. The smart relay functionality also allows for a push-pull so that you can instantly continue reading an email or a text on your phone that you started on your watch, or vice versa. The Galaxy Gear supports hands-free talking when paired with your Galaxy smartphone, as well as voice control. Samsung has cleverly hidden a mic and speaker right behind the back of the strap to allow you to make and receive calls without ever having to take your phone out of your pocket. Not even Captain Kirk had that kind of gear. In terms of basic specs, the watch sports a 1.6 AMOLED screen featuring a resolution of 320 by 320. The watch charges via USB and promises a 25-hour battery life, though we know in real-world conditions it's probably closer to 20 hours. The Galaxy Gear will allow you to install custom gear-optimized apps, of which there are currently 70, through your Galaxy tablet or your Galaxy smartphone using the Gear Manager app. Other smart device standards include a gyroscope, an accelerometer, a touchscreen interface, and a variety of colors, including black, gray, orange, beige, gold, and lime green. In a feature we'll definitely file under cool, the camera also allows you to do real-time foreign language translation, which is pretty awesome. So there you have it, the first major entrant into the soon-to-explode smartwatch field. So what do you guys think? Does the Galaxy Gear extend the capabilities and conveniences of smartphones and tablets enough to justify itself? Or does its Samsung-only limitation make it too niche a product for a huge population of iPhone and other non-Galaxy device users? Let us know in the comments below and check back for all things tech right here on Big Shiny Things.